Hey guys, welcome back for uh, the second video in uh, weeks 14, Battle of the Hometown Heroes. So last night we did um, Kushwa's Kush IPA. Um, tonight, going to battle with the Kush is Astrolab Brewing's Private Universe. Check that can out. It's kind of it's kind of shiny, so I'm trying to get a good. Yeah, it's gonna be good. It's gonna be good. I'm excited. So Astrolab is another one of those breweries where people are like, "You live in Maryland and you haven't had Astrolab?" And I'm like, "No, dude, I haven't had it." So Astrolab and they are from um, Silver Spring, Maryland which is not too far from here. So the last beer I had last night is um, it's about 45 minutes away. And this beer is about 45 minutes away as well. So they're both like within a short drive. So I'm going to crack this bad boy. I'm using the same glass um, that I used last night. Of course, I washed it. but um, And this is not frozen. I checked before I, I started the recording on the video. Um, I'm using the same glass. Now this looks exactly the same as the beer we drank last night. Uh, the color is exactly the same. Not as much head though. I'm going to dump it all out. Alright, so there it is. Now it looks exactly the same. It's, it's hazy. Kind of looks like orange juice, but it's a little darker. It looks a little darker. Now this smells like it. This smells a little more malty. I'm getting more of a creamy smell from this beer. It's 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 very. It does smell citrusy like the beer last night, but it smells it smells a lot creamier and it just smells it smells sweeter. If 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 a beer can smell sweeter, I don't know. It does smell really good. Can't wait to try it. Wow. Okay. So this this beer does taste a lot different than the beer last night. This beer, um, hold on a second, my thing's beeping. This beer tastes like it has a, a little more alcohol in it. It does taste, um, it is a lot heavier. This is more of a medium bodied beer as opposed to last night's uh, light, light medium bodied beer. Um, it is very citrusy. I don't know, this just tastes, it tastes way different. This tastes a lot fruitier. I'm getting more of like a mango, more like a mango, like tropical notes in this beer than I was last night. Last night was just, it was just straight grapefruit, like hard citrus. And this is more of a fruity beer. And you do taste the malt. The malt is, um, it's like kind of like an like an earthy kind of it's kind of hard to describe it's kind of like a it's kind of like a caramel malt that i love caramel malts in my in my ipas just for all the brewers out there if you're watching this caramel malt is is my shit and i i love caramel malt especially how it balances out the hoppy notes and, the, and hops beers and ipas it just it just it just goes very well with an IPA, and any any IPA beer that has caramel malt, uh, I'm gonna favor it over the other beer. So, I hate to say it, but the other beer is gonna lose on this one. I'm just telling you that right off the bat. Um, this beer is just is just better. It's just better. I mean, it, it's more it's more it's I wouldn't say it's more balanced because both of the beers are very well balanced, and they're both very good beers. Both of these beers are great representations of what Maryland beers have to offer. They are um, phenomenal. Um, this this beer is just it's just really really good. It's it's got me it's got me thinking it's like a 74. Sweet kid. All right, Astro Lab Brewing, Private Universe, Double Indian IPA. Okay, so that's why it's a double IPA, and I love double IPAs. I'm a double IPA kind of guy. 8% alcohol, so it does have a lot more alcohol, and you can taste that. You can taste that. It, you can taste the difference in the alcohol. It says here, um, it has. Uh, I can barely read it. 
Nelson, Savine, El Dorado, and Citrus Hops. So it has an extra uh, layer of hops in this beer. Um, it says, drink fresh. We are a small independent craft brewery, brewery proudly producing hop forward and innovative beers in Silver Spring, Maryland. We experiment with techniques and ingredients to create unique but well-balanced beers. We hope you will come and visit us. Cheers, Matt and Emma. So Matt and Emma, um, hats off to you guys. You brewed an excellent, excellent beer. Um, I really, really like this beer. Uh, Private Universe. I will be looking for more Astro Lab beer. I'm also going to be looking for um, more of the Kushwa beer because both of these beers are really good. Kushwa has a beer called Big Kush, which is their double Kush. So I'm going to be looking for that. Um, they have a couple other ones that I've heard about that I, I need to be on the lookout for. But Astro Lab, you guys are definitely, I'm, I'm definitely going to try to find some more of this. Um, when life's a little hazy, when life's a little crazy, I do that every freaking, every second video it seems like I do. Okay, so when life's a little crazy, get yourself a little hazy, get yourself a little freaking Astro Lab hazy IPA because it's very good. And um, stay thirsty, my friends. I'll see you next week. I got some more IPA next week that we're going to be jumping into. Um, yeah, IPA. IPA all the way. So I'll see you guys then. All right, take it easy. See you in a week. Peace.